this. I'm in. <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> I'm in. This grin. Can we talk? I mean, can we talk? Hi sis, welcome to Fab Chic Modest. How are you doing? Here on Fab Chic Modest, we talk everything fashion, how to look fabulous, chic, elegant, feminine, sophisticated, edgy, and modest on the budget. So my name is Doris and I'm your host. If this is your first time, thank you so much for checking out my video. And if you're a returning watcher, you are a sis already, you have subscribed, thank you so much, I love you. So for today's video, we are going to talk about the fashion trends for 2023 yes the year is still young kind of it's almost March can you believe it <laughs> but I decided to still make this video because we have a lot of fashion trends like every season and every year and um, right now we are about to get into the spring season um, however you know you need to pick what style what look actually speaks to you what trends and it doesn't mean necessarily that you are following trends per se but you know something that you are excited to actually purchase and um, implement in your wardrobe either even through thrifting or buying retail whatever you know wherever you shop it gives you also an idea on how to refresh your own look so I think it'll be a fun video to talk about what we'll be seeing a lot of for 2023 um, you know down the runway and it's going to translate into the stores and what we will be seeing more of being sold the first trend I wanted to speak of today is the maxi dresses and maxi skirts the maxi dress is having a moment right now it is everywhere on all of the runways and also like very dramatic length you know and a lot of like different hems asymmetrical kind of like zigzaggy kind of hems and very like a lot of like pockets and unfinished hems and a lot of really interesting details like edgy details to the maxi skirt and maxi dress which i love also the romantic side of the maxi dress and i'm going to insert some pictures of a few looks that i have worn here on this channel even right now i am spotting a maxi dress that i love so much this is a dress actually that i purchased probably five to six years ago from shein yes this is one of my <laughs> One of my rarest Shein purchases, like clothing wise, that I fell in love with when I first started discovering the brand. And so I go to Shein, like I always say, mostly for accessories, but sometimes something may speak to me and I can try it out. So I love this dress. It is so light, it's polyester. First of all, the color is just gorgeous. And so when I saw the length and the flow, it's got pockets, you know, just like very flowy very majestic and you can also wear like a vest on top of it you can add a cardigan you can add a blazer it's such a versatile dress that i love it so you can definitely find so many different good nice uh, maxi dresses like by thrifting i love thrifting and so a lot of my maxi dresses i have bought from the thrift store i love goodwill salvation army if you're in an area where they actually have savers for example and also like those you know um holes in the wall kind of thrift stores you never know what good is you may find in those so since this is now the moment to load up on your maxi skirt your maxi dresses i feel like maxi dresses are so easy to style up like to accessorize because it's just one piece you see what i mean um sometimes whenever i want to wear like one of my skirts or like my maxi skirts now you have to think about which top to wear on top of it you have to, so it's more deconstructed but if you have like a maxi dress and you just want a fast free feminine just chic easy look you just put it on that's it you put your accessories bam bam like today just simple you just dress up you know so and it's so appropriate for so many different occasions you can wear them pretty much anywhere um depending on the color now on the prints and patterns in some professional settings it may not be possible it depends on where you work but a maxi dress is just so feminine. It's the epitome of femininity. I love me a good maxi dress and I love to layer pieces over them. So this is perfect. And we've seen even Zara, we've seen H&M, they're really like selling those maxi dresses. And also because we're about to embark into the spring before we know it, it's summertime. So 
summer means dresses you know light dresses very airy midi dresses you know so just have at it enjoy it because we're everywhere so i'm all for it maxi dresses Let's talk about the second trend that I have observed. It's about the cargo pants. Yes, sis, the cargo pants. I mean, it was a thing. I literally remember me in high school. I loved, loved me a good cargo pants. It was all the rage. You know, if you know, you know. Um, late 90s, early 20s, with the R&B and hip hop era, you know. I loved me some good cargo pants and like nothing is new on every song, they are back trendy again and right now they are everywhere there are all kinds and styles of cargo pants you can find them like in silk you can find them like in satin you can find them in like um like parachute styles that are selling a lot of them right now um denim style you can find them in camo prints and since i kid you not the best place to actually get your cargo pants on a budget is a thrift store i have actually thrifted so many cargo pants before it was a thing <laughs> this season um at the thrift store you know like very nice edgy like in the camo like a blue tone um with a brown tone you know you have so many different choices there on the budget especially if you shop in the men's section and so cargo pants are everywhere now of course we know they're very exaggerated very baggy and lots of pockets you know down and those are really cool i've seen a lot of, of celebrities and influencers wearing those and those can be very costly you don't have to break the bank for that the high street is selling a lot of them um, the thrift stores are selling them so I actually got a pair of cargo pants myself this season from Zara it's currently being sold and this is like a pair of dark navy blue um, cargo pants and I love that pair okay this is a pair of pants I was talking about this is from Zara and this is so good I'll insert the link down below and I love baggy pants honestly I don't like really like tight things on me like even for jeans I love wide leg jeans and uh, you know something that it's flowy that lets you know aeration I mean come on <laughs> it's very long it's very nice I just love love this pair of pants and I believe it was what $50 or so I will set the link down below you can go check it out but you know everywhere H&M check out all those stores online or um, inside the store because with cargo pants you can really style them in such a cool way you can actually elevate them with a blazer for example you can wear them with a bodysuit with a button down shirt with a short sleeve shirt with a t-shirt with what else with a with a cardigan with a duster with a kimono sis and i actually made a video on different ways to style um, your cargo pants and it works it really works and of course you can make it feminine by also wearing some stilettos a nice pair of boots some western cowboy boots you can wear like a pair of tennis shoes you can wear some sandals with it some mules some platform boots yes yeah, so this is beautiful this is perfect but like i said you know go to your three stores you can get them for much cheaper i'm always trying to save us some coins here <laughs> So the third trend is what they call like the, the goth glamour, like you know, kind of like a soft side of like a gothic look when you're wearing black. And so I'm not really like into goth styles, but I love creating edgy outfits. And a few of my outfits I have composed even here on this channel were based off of black. I love me a good 
black monochromatic look i feel like you know you can really elevate this color you can really look chic and sophisticated um by wearing different textures of black for example um a nice blazer like some textured with something more silky or satiny at the bottom and so i love this trend i feel like you know you really pushes you to kind of like look chic in black because it's so easy to just wear anything black and you know because a lot of people are more comfortable with black but i feel like to look edgy in black is also adding some very nice accessories it could be edgy it's up to you but i actually um did a tweet for lookbook here on this channel i would say that one of the looks kind of catch on this um, on this trend um i wore my zara satin dress that I bought years ago and it has spaghetti straps and because I don't show like my arms so I decided to wear a thrifted cape that I bought from the Goodwill Bands um, in Miami and since the whole look was so chic instead of just wearing a regular blazer I think it was very unexpected and I think I was calling it my little black riding hood um, so yes I feel like when it's cool outside you don't necessarily need to wait for Halloween to wear this kind of like edgy look yes be be free to experiment with fashion i feel like you know fashion is fun and this is a way to express your creativity and who you are as well so i just love this look i believe i wore like a pair of platform boots um from nine west and uh, yeah with the cape of course you don't have to um put the hoods on of course i wanted to be dramatic for the video you know me <laughs> the gothic glam really plays out with different textures of black and how to still look ladylike like refined um, not necessarily grungy you know with wearing all black so this is definitely something you can implement in your own wardrobe you know like if you are used to wearing like a pair of black jeans for example um you can add like a nice black blouse to make it more feminine you can add a nice pair of like even ballet flats you don't have to necessarily wear heels to be elegant you can add some very cute jewelry like gold or silver um to make it to make it pop you know make it more polished and yeah i just love this look i think it's really cute it's really cute so yeah watch out i'm going to make a lookbook actually i need to make a lookbook on how to look chic in a monochromatic um, black ensemble like outfits and so it's going to be exciting because so many different textures of black you know you can wear velvet and still be black velvet something like jumpsuits or pants or dress and be so chic The fourth trend that I wanted to speak on is the denim. Denim is such like a timeless like piece. This is like a staple in our clothing, in fashion. Denim can be translated in so many different clothing and um, styles and accessories. And of course, denim is having a moment everywhere. Denim on denim, triple denim. I mean, I'm, I love it. I love it because then you can really like add so many different elements, so many different colors of denim. You can add like even chambray, you know, to your denim look to make it look like a double denim. If you're wearing like a denim skirt, for example, you can add like a chambray shirt, back and down shirt. You can like tie it even at your waist and look really chic. I bought actually several items from Zara um, like that were of denim. Even like my cargo pants here, this is like a denim. It can be like the dark wash, it could be faded, it could be tie-dye, it doesn't matter. I've seen so many like denim jumpsuits, um, denim skirts, denim pencil skirts, denim dresses, denim, every, denim coats, denim accessories like denim belts, um, denim bags. So I actually thrifted a few, I think I have one denim bag that I'm like, oh, I'll get you out. Yes, yes, yes. So I, I'm planning on also making like a, um, a lookbook, just denim, 
Ooh, it's gonna be good. Just with denim, like five looks, just based off of denim, and I think it's gonna be so good. So you don't want to miss out, sis. Make sure that you have subscribed to my channel because it's gonna be fire. I'm so excited to compose those looks. You know, I love styling as much as we love shopping. I love styling as well. I feel like you know you can keep buying, buying, and buying, but you really don't know how to put things together, how to be versatile, how to just be fun and interesting and creative with your looks. That's where all the fun is, honestly. So just to create persona to your look, you can be preppy today, tomorrow, you can be edgy, you can be street style, you can be ladylike, chic. I mean, fashion is so fun. And we see a lot of inspiration also from army, camo, like into our denim, you know, like denim jackets. Um, with different pockets, kind of like oversized because I feel like until now when you talk about a denim jacket it was mostly a fitted like jacket but now denim is having like so much freedom so much creative freedom I feel like so the creators, the designers are coming with all different kinds of denim so you can experiment this year with double denim if you have never done so Now, the last trend I wanted to speak with you about is cowboy western boots. They are everywhere and this is so awesome because I love them. Back in the days, for some reason, I used to feel like, oh, you can only wear them with like skinny jeans if you tuck your skinny jeans in them. But since the cowboy boots has been revolutionized, I mean, you can wear them with anything. You can wear them everywhere pretty much. You can wear them to school. You can wear them to work. You can wear them to like it, nice restaurants. I mean, there's a way to style them up and also they come with different styles, colors and designs. So definitely have at it. So I just wanted to show you a few of mine to give you ideas on how you can style your cowboy boots. And the good thing is also they come in different heights. So you can wear them like Kind of like booty style like the the height of it or tall cowboy boots so the first one i wanted to show you this i thrifted and this is such a nice pair of cowboy boots i love the suede and the color i mean it can even go well with the dress i'm wearing right now of course so you know all this brown and earthy tones beige they go with a lot of things so yeah this is a nice pair i bought i've had it for years this is from massimo which is a target brand and so i thrifted it not more than ten dollars the next pair is kind of like similar to the first one but this has more of a polished look and i like it and i believe i wore this in my cargo um pants lookbook like you know how to style your cargo pants video and i love this because whenever you're wearing like a pair of pants for example you only see the tip of it i think it's so cute or you can also wear this like with a midi dress a midi skirt you can wear this with you know like something a bit shorter so we can see it in its full glory i feel like this is so cute what did i buy this from hmm i wonder um it says super something let me say super made i don't know maybe i bought it online i'm not sure which store but i love this style you know it has a lot of like patterns kind of like crack effects on it and i love the darkened tip oh, this is gorgeous and this is not leather but it's so nice it's so resistant i love this detail as well and this has carried me for years i've had it for years actually and very comfortable very nice you can wear this definitely to work you can definitely wear this like anywhere pretty much so this is the new pair that i purchased from zara um over the sales and this is leather this sold for i believe like a hundred and something dollars and over the sales i believe i got it for 39 dollars and this was definitely a steal i love the style of these shoes the color the pattern very like mexico aztec 
um, kind of print looking. I love the trimmings, the color block, the different colors, uh, the quirk effects, the shine. I mean, I love the style. It's very comfortable as well. The heel is not um, too tall and the pointy toes, I mean, it will be part of my haul um, from Zara and this shoe, sis, come on now. This is so elevated, so elevated, so nice. So I'm really glad I got them because they're on the website forever on sale. And I'm like, don't have something similar. I don't really need it. At the end of the day, I was like, okay, I'll just get it. If I don't like it, I'll return it. And I kept it, surprise. <laughs> So I love this. This is very edgy. I can see myself with like a very big billowy um, maxi dress, for example. Even with what I'm wearing, yes, you can wear. Oh my gosh, yes, yes, it goes well. Beautiful. Because this is kind of like a burgundy color, but you know it goes well with a brown as well, and you don't necessarily have to be matchy matchy, anyways. So I love this. I love the combo, the mix of the black and the white and the burgundy like aubergine color this is beautiful yes oh, gorgeous gorgeous and this one says add drama i actually have like a tall black pair of cowboy boots that i thrifted uh not sure where it is i mean i know but you know i don't want to go deep to deep like <laughs> so i have that and also have a pair of like black booties as well like cowboy boots this is such a statement piece i really wanted to include it in this video and this is gorgeous it actually kind of looks like the short version that i just purchased but yeah it actually kind of look similar yeah you can see it i really really love it this is something zara will actually um sell often like every year on the website so or you can also go to H&M you can go to end of stories is it end of stories or end of B stories <laughs> end of stories you can go to um, yeah just go to those retail store check out the three stores because of course they always have those a lot of people don't it's the cowboy um, boots and yeah even if they look like manly try them on sis try them on and so those are really nice to go with anything it really gives you so many different ways to style up something and yeah i'm so glad i got them of course you know me and my colors i've given you subdued colors colors you used to already black and whatnot if you really want to go like them with a pop of color those are from nine west and i bought them last year I mean, sis, I mean, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I mean, this green. Can we talk? I mean, can we talk? This green, this is actually leather from Nine West. I bought it last year. It was on sale. I think over Black Friday sales, I think back in November. And uh, hmm, I was like, you know what? Let me check it out. I mean, green has been having a moment with all with different shades of green different brands have really really maximized the sales with green colors purses clutches jackets you name it everything has been definitely um made with a, in green you know so i love this i feel like you can wear something actually simple monochromatic and still add this at the bottom i mean come on sis i love the metal tip here so beautiful of course i love all of the um, i love the design the etching um, in the leather ah, so western yes yes ah thank you so much sis for watching this video i really hope that you have enjoyed it um you know going through all of the trends and let me know down in the comments which trend speaks most to you, to your personal style, or which trend would you like to maybe try out um, that you're not really familiar or comfortable with? And uh, yeah, let's keep the discussion going. Um, thank you so much. Please subscribe to my channel, like this video, share with your network of sis so we can grow our community. And as always, stay blessed and see you soon.